G'day mates, it's Stan Darty here with Survive Succeed Stan D. That's the show where we take outback survival tactics and apply them to the spiritual quandaries you might be facing every single day. Today, I got a letter from my friend Daniel from Oshkosh, Wisconsin. That's a mouthful, ain't it? Dear Stan D, please help. I'm completely frustrated. I try so hard to be good, but I just can't do it. Every day I get in trouble for being mean to my little brother. Then the next day I wake up and resolve that I'm not going to lose my temper with him, but then he does something that's so aggravating, and I lose my cool again. It isn't even just the stuff with my brother. Every day I tell myself I'm not going to sass back to my mom today, or I'm not going to be selfish or boastful or unkind but every day I fail in one way or another. It kind of feels like I'm trying to cover myself with a blanket that's too small. As soon as I get one part of my body tucked in, the blanket comes off another part. As soon as I think I've conquered one bad habit, another bad habit gets the better of me. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm beginning to wonder how God can still love me when I keep messing up all the time. I hope you can help me. Take heart, Daniel. You aren't the first kid who's messed up a lot. I myself was a rascal when I was an ankle biter. It reminds me of this Bible verse where Paul said in Romans, what I want to do, I don't do. And what I hate to do, I do. Crikey, it makes me just all flustered just thinking about it. Daniel, I like your blanket analogy, but I got a better one. Eh, trying to be good all the time. It's like trying to defend yourself from all these mozzies. Yeah. Mozzies are what we call mosquitoes down under. Sometimes when there's a swarm of them, there's nothing you can do to keep them all away. That's when I reach for my handy dandy mozzie spray. You see, mozzie spray. And when I spray this around, it forms an invisible barrier that makes those mozzies want to cry home to mama. This invisible barrier hits them in their gorners. Mozzie spray keeps me safe. Daniel, when those sin mosquitoes come for you, you can't fend them off either. You need some protection. Like here it says in the Bible, God tells us God uh, demonstrated his own love for us and why were you yet sinners? Jesus died for us. You see, Jesus has got it covered. He's got everything you need. Ephesians 2.8 says, For by grace you've been saved through faith. This is not of your own doing. It's the gift of God, not a result of works. So when the sin mosquitoes come at you, you don't have to fight them off because Jesus has done everything that you need. 